The funny thing is it has a little frowny face next to the 11%. <laughs> I guess it's like it's not human enough. Frowny face. <laughs> but it's always dry in here because, like, technically my air conditioner is, like, well, it doesn't keep up in the summer because I don't really have insulation. But it runs a lot, so it's always cooking all the, all the, taking all the water out of here, right? So even like right now where it's not super humid outside, but I'm running my air conditioner in here. So it's like super dry in here. And my issue is just TV that runs almost 24 seven and the computer and monitors. Yeah. So what is our humidity? Humidity is only 25% outside. So yeah. By the time you run your air conditioner, well, there goes all your, all your moisture. So, which is fine. I don't mind it being dry, but at the same time, it's a little too dry. I deal with like, kind of a constant sore throat. To be honest. And my issue is, is like, where do I put it in my room or halfway? What the humidifier? My room and yeah. Well, you spend most of the time in your room. I'd put it in your room. I, I know, but I also like, I walk around. Well, the house. I understand that, yeah. But once you run an air conditioner, it's gonna zap all your moisture anyway, so. Yeah. But you know, there is a thing as a whole home humidifier. If you have oh. like forced air. Yeah. Uh, but that's mostly for in the winter. But, yeah. Alright, well we made it up to, up to there anyway, so that's good. Now we see if we can back up to mine number two. Let's see what we can do. I think my sister's house had a whole home humidifier when she bought it. And it was literally like just a water line run into your furnace. And I'm just like, what the heck is that? Yeah, I'd never seen one before at that time. It was that very seems pretty smart. Yeah, for in the winter, it makes sense. You know, in the summertime, you want it to be dry in your house because it's so darn humid outside, you can't stand it. But in the winter, you can get too dry and then, yeah. I mean, it's springtime as well. Yeah, yeah. Alright, please make it. Please make it. You can do it, buddy. Problem is we get a bit of an awkward uh, line of cars here, but we'll figure it out. It's fine. Big dealio. Yeah, picking up speed, actually. Look at us go. Come out. Zap all the water out of this engine while I'm up here. All right. Hopefully that light there is red and that doesn't go past because that's where those bunch of those, some of those cars need to go. Some need to go here. We'll get it figured out. Oh, I was up at Appalachian Hardwood, or, or not Appalachian, uh, Robinson Cole. There were four more, four more cars up there, but they were all for uh, Andrews. I'm like, yeah, might as well grab those. So they're on that train too, but it's only like 3,000 tons. It should be okay. It'll be fine. That's, that's not bad. Well, I'll have four Brookshires, so. That'll be the first time we'll have all four hooked up going up the hill. Last time was three, so. Eh, four should be okay. Four should be just fine. I hope. This track's up here. 
And there's two Silva cars here, Trent. Two Silvas. All right, while we have momentum, we're just going to go ahead and push these back all the way. And then I'll have to pull forward to let this car go into here, and then I'll back the other ones up. But while we have momentum, we might as well back these in. Momentum is our friend, after all. Well, I could stop, put that car there, and then... No, it's fine. It'll buff. It will be fine. Really, once we get up here, it's not that steep. All right, lock them down. Yeah, we go forward. No, oh, don't take out. Don't give me money for those cars yet. They're not. <laughs> uh, me and you. <laughs> I was like, those cars aren't done yet. No, don't give me money for them. <laughs> uh, it's funny. As long as you st those cars are stopped, they gave you money. Yeah, I know. All right. Okay, so let's apply. Ah, where's that chainsaw at, chat? Cut down a few trees up here would be uh, okay by me. Oh, come on, car. You know you want to roll. Is this flat here? I don't want to get out and push. Mostly because my, my guy's sitting back at CTC. Right, well that's doing what I thought. There it goes. Okay, now it's taking off. Okay. That took forever to move. Must have had to wait for an earthquake. Or something. That took forever. Oh man, I was like, I've done this before. I know this works. Now we got to get this in here just enough to where, you know, it's out of our way. And not clobber in the bumper too much because I can't stand the noise. All right, there we go. And we'll go spot these cars back where they belong. And then we'll grab those two, go get that other car drop those off at you know the yard and then we'll be uh, good to go I go take a break then Train far enough back, which means I'm probably gonna have to hook up to these again. Get my train far enough back to get on the other track, and then we can push those two, and then it'll be they'll be on the same end as that uh, same end as that other one. Power outage out that way. Where? Uh, Jefferson County. Okay. I have no idea why. Uh, Jefferson County, like Missouri? Is that what you're getting at? Yep. That's probably a meth lab blew up. Uh, That's right. I need to find that on my radar Omega and turn it on. Man. Or maybe not, because it gets too cluttery sometimes anyway. I accidentally like dragged my mouse over to like so I could see it better. Yeah. What did it do? 
What happened? No! Trent! <laughs> In the arms of the angels. Look, that's why I gave it. Fly away. The safety rate is definitely going to be zero now. That's three cars. Three cars. It's all right, mate. <laughs> you can't park this, huh? Black out there's in the bits. <laughs> in the arms of the angel. Our safety rating flies away. <laughs> hey, Trent, how about you say tapped in the, in the railroad? I, I, I thought I was. <laughs> I said it in the, like, the plus key, because that's, like, the, the key bind for, like, slow down. Uh-huh. <laughs> and it was zooming in on <laughs> Omega. Your license shambles. <laughs> and, uh, and then I realized, oh, hey. Wrong, wrong tab. Wrong tab. I had right as soon as I could get to it, it was a bit. Oh, God. Yep, it's going to be zero for sure now. Trent is being tapped out, Tony, today. Give me a welcome back. Yeah, RIP to the safety rating, right? RIP. Got one. I fall powder outage. Got my A's engine. Darn power outage at Jefferson County. It's probably a meth lab, like I said. Wouldn't surprise me. Meth lab that, uh, 28 customers are out. It pops up for 20 customers. Uh, 2.8. Oh, oh. 691 people. Oh, okay. That's still kind of crazy. It pops up for that few. Oh. 25,125 customers are tracked. Damn. I... <laughs> it's okay. It's only a video game. Right? Only a video game. Doesn't really matter. The points don't matter, and well, neither does the safety rating. <laughs> oh man! All right, let's see if we can go get that one car. I wasn't sure how many full cars I was gonna have, so I was just hoping to make it back to here. You know, not. Release. Release the Kraken. Come on. You're waiting for an engraved invitation? Like, what's what's the deal, yo? Should uh, roll down the hill. I mean, the track's not flat at all. Come on. Can I hit you with my camera? All right. Don't roll. That's fine, too. We'll just come get you then. I have my character here. I could push it, but I don't have my character. He's sitting at the CTC ward. That's kind of where he lives. Just saying. All right, so we need to. What? Trying are you messing with the car now? can see you applying the brakes and releasing the brakes. It just started to move right before I hit it. Did you push it? Are you here? No. 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 I was just... It... Apparently it, was, it moved the car just by doing that. Wow. I say it was, yeah, going all crazy. Interesting. Very, and, very. Uh, that one guy's looking at a red board, John. What? One of your AI guys looking at a red board. That's okay. Let him. Oh, it's gonna. That's fine. It'll stop the fusey. That's fine. All right. So that probably is the triple header, the double header engine. Yeah. That I didn't really want to go this far, but it went this far. 
<laughs> and that's the red board I found right there. Yeah. Look at that. So the problem is we got these here, uh, these here cars that go a mile and a half back that way. So, uh, all right, let's go back that way, buddy. Uh, but go slow. Cause I need to take a break there, buddy. <laughs> How about that? Um, let's just give them, I know we don't have to go that far, but we'll just throw some lights that way. Why not? There's a power outage of Bryson City on the radar. Is there really? That's funny. All right, I'm going to let this climb the hill, Trent. I'll be here. Alrighty, chat. Thanks for sticking around. Do appreciate y'all being here, West Pap. And thanks for spending some time with us on a Friday. Eh, it's afternoon. Almost evening. Appreciate y'all being here, chat. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is going to work out perfect, by the way. That was perfect timing, huh? No? I love when a plane comes together, huh? Gotta love it. Anyway, let's get back to it. Sound Train. Honey. What's up? Uh, not much. Two goes there and one goes there. Okay. Not much? Good. Checking Didn't... out this map. Oh, you're, you're too cool. You're, you're not playing, brother. Oh, I'm doing both. Oh, God. The safety rating, Trent. <laughs> Oh, man. This is the scene of the crime, by the way. Right here, chat. This is it. This is where it happened. <laughs> the steam engines are the ones that cause problems. Whack. Wham. Played a game of whack. Uh, well, you know. Bud sickle the other day, you know. <laughs> <laughs> That's what really happened. <laughs> oh, man. You already start with cows. This is kind of perfect, though, to have an engine, like, for each way here on each side. Of these. This is perfect. Perfect. Don't have to do anything funny here. I can just, you know, do my thing. That's an expensive go. tractor. What do you want about? 715. Oh, yeah. Oh, you got that, too? I downloaded it, yeah. Nice. Then no, it was actually out, out. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Righty. These cars don't really belong. That is quite a, like, interesting little track here. Alright, let me drop that. And then T3 is right behind you. Yeah, so about that. Helps if you put your train in reverse. I could probably kick it down there, right? Oh, yeah. L3FT4 D3 at JDX100. What does John and Swift have in common chat? Their safety rating and... I eat crayons. L3FT4 D3 at JDX420. <laughs> Hey, for the record, Mr. Left. Rude. Secondly. Big facts. Uh, secondly, Mr. Trent has caused, caused two derailments today. Oh, In game day. One. In game day. Two. I've only had one. Thank you. On the in game day. Not like today, today, but in game. So, no, just, just just throwing that out there, Lefty, but thanks for the bits. Do appreciate them. How's it going? Three and four are all right there. Oh, so that's down. Okay. Yeah, four is behind three. I didn't realize there was a difference. I just thought this was all one like thing. Are you running the brakes on this thing, or is it just going that slow? That's a, that's all you. Okay, I'll say. Going awful slow. Awful, awful slow. Trent took out the power lines in Jefferson County, Missouri. Kind of weird. Trent, you could at least come by and say hi. For those of you that don't know, Jefferson County is like south, St. Louis, south of St. Louis. You know, it's like right there, though. 
All right, that car is going to stay with a brake on. Just because of the hill there. And then we're ready to go. And we got one more car here to spot in when we get where we're going with that. Three miles down the track. Not bad. Don't do it again, John. Don't do it. <laughs> See, the only difference between between when I cause an issue on here and when Trent causes an issue, most of the time you guys don't see the issues that Trent causes, okay? You guys only get to see the ones that I cause. You just hear. You just get to hear and see a little, little OSHA violation there, you know? <sighs> so. That is all. Wait for some air before we just waste water and coal. About halfway on water, not bad. Yeah, mom. We're awaiting. But yeah, you guys don't get to see trans issues, usually. So. <laughs> Trent has a clean safety. Whatever shot. <laughs> That's the biggest bunch of baloney I've ever heard, Doug. No offense, Trent, but, you know, he knows. But I gotta replow this grass. <laughs> I think we've lost Trent to a new farm sim map chat. <laughs> oh, you should be basically out of work by now, right? Yep. Yeah, we're kind of waiting on this this train, so it's all good. It is all good. It's better fish, man. Right? I won't fire up, will it? Yeah, it's fine. We're still, but we're still got a little air issue here, so but we're doing fine. We're doing just fine. You're sitting there watching your OSHA manual smolder. Well, so what year is this game based? Because I don't know if there was OSHA back then, you know? I don't know what year this game is based in. Because I know if we play Railroads Online, that was back in the 1800s. There's no OSHA, so... Sean, you found four interesting energy drinks at Walmart. Speaking of Walmart, there's something I want to, I want to, I want to, I need to go to Walmart to buy something. And I never say that. Yeah. What are they, Sean? <laughs> it's based in the 40s. Well, OSHA wasn't a thing to like think that's what, 60s, 70s? So then, we're golden. We are golden. I'm waiting to hear what these energy drinks are from Sean. <laughs> You're good. Let's go. No safety violations here. Exactly. We're good, John. We got a bell and a whistle. What more do you need? Do romance? <laughs> no. No more of those. You, you asked. No more of those. Interstate commerce was a thing back then? Okay. Gotcha. Oh, yeah. Interesting, John. Wow. That is very interesting, yeah. I don't know how I feel about that, but... Interesting. I think from now on, when Trent has a derail, he has to post a pic in Discord. <laughs> and then we all just, we all just look at the photo and go, shame, shame, right? Just like that, right? <laughs> uh, so Hidden Valley came out with something new that I, I saw a TikTok about it last night and I was like mm, I, okay 
they came out with a bunch of, of different ranches. So there's like a hot honey ranch, blah, blah, all these different ones, right? One of them is Cheez-It Ranch. So like Cheez-Its, like the cracker, but ranch. I think that sounds delightful. Well, Just I so. wouldn't be down to tr at least try it, but... It means drinking it's lemonade. Just... Lemonade. Le lem lemonade. Yeah, I had some of that too, but it was in Mountain Dew. Dude, I love me a good lemonade. The, the pink lemonade? It's okay. I'm more of a regular From lemonade guy. Mountain Dew? I've never had that, no. No. Cheese it. Only... Dude, cheese it rants on like chicken strips or fries or any of that. Like that kind of. It sounds so good to me. It sounds so good. Apparently, it gives off like cheese sauce vibes. I like cheese sauce. The same. Who doesn't? I like cheese sauce. So I gotta, I gotta. Apparently, like I, Amazon doesn't sell it yet. So I gotta go to Walmart. So yeah. It's Hidden Valley. Yeah, it's Hidden Valley Ranch, but it's. All kinds of different flavors. All kinds of different flavors. Oh, this uh, three thousand, almost one twenty eight hundred, twenty nine hundred. Not working this solo engine here. Throwing that out there. I don't know. I think it sounds great. I'm not a big sauce guy either. That's the weird thing. Like honey mustard's about as adventurous as I normally get. Like, I've never tried sriracha, okay? Like, not really my thing. And a bunch of sauces is not really my thing. Like, I don't have to have ketchup on my fries, you know? But cheese at ranch sounds... Sounds good to me. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I mean, Chick-fil-A sauce is good. Raising cane sauce is good, but I don't have to have them. Although cane sauce you kind of do if you get cane chicken, it's kind of kind of plain. So nice to have a little swass with it. Swass. A little bit of swass. Hey, boss. Yeah, that's right, boss. Good night. This this is this is this is torture right now, chat. With this one engine. I mean, I guess I could throttle up the second one, but. Not a huge sauce person. Yeah, like I said, I'm not either, Kimmy. Like uh, that toasted ravioli that I talk about all the time, like that is a a St. Louis staple, but it's always served with like marinara, like a red sauce, right? I can't, I just eat it plain. I don't need swass. Big swass. I don't need swass. I don't need it. I'll try Go that fine. new auger. Do what? Uh, there was a nogger that came out not oh. too long ago. It's like a, I don't know, 40 oh, nice. foot. Very nice. The brand I have, I've never heard about. Oh. Uh, Hutchinson. Never heard of that. I haven't either. Is it bad I'm running both these engines separately so that I can like get through these curves and get down here to <laughs> into hollow? Okay, you go with 30. You had 32. <laughs> Pretty much. It's terrible. But at least you can just look at, or hover over. I just click on it, yeah. The, or shift click. Yeah. Yeah, it's not or a big control, deal. Control shift click, and then a little here, shift click there. Yeah. Yeah, Chick fil A sauce is good. Yeah, don't get me wrong. I, I do. I do enjoy some Chick fil A sauce from time to time. I don't really eat Chick Fil A a lot, though. Hey, Kimmy, do you put swass on a uh, on a hot dog? Swass. Yeah, swass. Is ketchup a swass? Or mustard? Are those sauces? I know ketchup and mustard are in a lot of sauces. If I'm eating a hot dog, it's just ketchup. Yeah, I just put ketchup on it. I don't need on that relish. Yeah, just ketchup. Can't stand relish. 
At least I just put just ketchup. Nothing else. Yeah. Or if I'm feeling crazy, like cheese, you know? Cheese, oh, cheese on a hot dog? So good. So good. Yeah. Yeah, but uh, AC, what about the burger? The Whataburger spicy ketchup? The only thing you put ketchup on is fries. So you don't put. Yeah, but Dude, that mustard's still a sauce. Sean, right? That's still uh, a sauce, Kimmy. See, I just can't eat regular. Oh, bye, Kimmy. Okay, bye. Goodbye. Okay, oh, man. Oh, speaking of game, but... All right. Oh, let's... you know, they start tomorrow at 5, I think. Who that? Uh, the, the line I basketball, I think they've... 6 Eastern, it's Boston time. Yeah. All right. I don't know. We haven't been to, like, the Sweet 16 or, like, where we are now mm -hmm. in 19 years. Oh, wow. All right, let's go uh, run this car back up yonder and, you know, see what we can do with it. Come back for the rest of that train later. Where? After we grab a couple more engines, that is. Got more engines. Um, yeah, Sean, I'm telling you, it sounds good, though. Damn. In the car wash, I have no idea. They have like a subscription at a car wash or something, or I, I don't know. Are you saying just because it's raining, you don't need like to wash your car? Is that what you're saying? Probably. All right, we need to get that coal car out of here, too. Definitely need to get that out of here, but actually, here, let's let's AI this guy back. Then we can grab the next train and get that car out of here. Actually, let's grab. Yeah, we need to grab that one. Need to grab this one. Throw some air on that train. I've never really even used that one. What's that? Oh, the thing that Jeff is talking about. It's from Black Sheep Modding. Like their new lime fertilizer spreader. Gotcha. Try to stick with. I really like that Pro Force. The Pro Force and, and the uh, yeah. interrogator I got. Cause, granted, they they do the same job. Oh, I got you, Sean. Okay, I got you. I got you. I don't know, Sean. I don't know. But it is annoying when you want to do something and, like, the place is closed or whatever like that, right? Right. Right. It is annoying. All right, so we're going to grab that coal car. Oh. Because why not? Speaking of, speaking of uh, cars, so that Santa Fe I was telling you about? Yeah. If you... Put the fusee in the right position. You can get it to where it will fill with water. Oh, wow. Nice. Uh, I have not seen any. I, I know that the 715 came out today, but beyond that, I don't know. I haven't uh, been on Farm Sim at all today. But I know the 715 came out in some map that Trent's been waiting for. It has also come out today. Not in the Mod Hub, though. I assume not in the mod hub, right? Oh, this won't be in the mod hub. Yeah, that's what I thought. This has too many cool features on it. Too many cool features, huh? Oh, yeah. Beyond that, I know nothing. All right? Know nothing. I know nothing. You know nothing, Jon Snow. If you know, you know. If you don't, sorry. 
from Game of Thrones, the original, like OG series. Just saying. <laughs> yeah, that one scene that happened to you. What? In, in your garage. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Set up a motion detector this, this year before. <laughs> Before House of the Dragon. <laughs> Waller, what's going on? For Why those, not? Oh, gotta, listen, gotta, gotta go. Listen, for those of you that have seen Game of Thrones, you know that there are some adult themed <laughs> parts of a Game of Thrones, right? And obviously, I'm an adult, so whatever, it doesn't matter. But. <laughs> I think it was it was during House of the Dragon last year, and I like had all my lights turned off out here, and I had my headphones on, and I'm I'm watching House of the Dragon, right? And the next thing I know, my dad is standing next to me, <laughs> and it was during an adult themed part of House of the Dragon. <laughs> he didn't care, obviously. We never talked about it, but like you know, it's just awkward, you know. It's it's just awkward, so yeah, <laughs> it's just awkward. Actually, Trent, this happened. I haven't I haven't told anybody. Happened Thursday or Wednesday at the farm. Well, let me let me backtrack. Something happened Wednesday at the farm that kind of reminded me of this, but like not at the same time, okay, at all. Yeah. Um, Dad was uh he went out to cut asparagus. Yeah. Okay, and somehow one of the farmers that the guy that technically actually farms uh, the farm, yeah. he rents it from his dad. He uh, he was at the farm. Oh, I need to push this. That's that's awkward. How 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 now how 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 Can you? Can I kick that into there and then pass and then? Anyway, so I'm sitting in the shed taking a little break, and Dad goes, "Hey, I'm gonna go out and cut asparagus." And I was like, "All right, that's fine." So I pulled my phone up and I'm scrolling TikTok, you know, as you do, as one does. And all of a sudden that farmer is like in our shed, in our shop, like poking his head, like into the plastic. Cause I was in the little plastic bubble at the time. And he's like poking his head in there like, Hey, where's your dad? And I was like, huh? It was kind of a, uh, it was kind of terrifying in a way. Okay, that was a massive, massive, massive fail. That did not work. That did not work. That did not work. So you might just have to... I think I can get it to work. I just need to pay attention a little better here. Okay, so if I go this way and then back in, I think I can get this to work. Because what I need to do is I need to kick the car over to here, and which actually I need to back, go first and back that car up more so I have more room to do this. And then I can kick it past or go to the other side of it. Yeah. But anyway, so Buddy Buddy or... scared the ever living tar out of me um, the other day at the farm, <laughs> which is not the first time I've been scared by those farmers. The, there was another time they. God, God, it was like nighttime and there was a thunderstorm moving in and I had just finished mowing the grass at the farm. Like it was dark, right? Pitch black outside. And I had just finished mowing the grass and uh, I was winding up the air hose. So I'm inside the shed and the nice, you know, it's all lit up and everything. And, uh, right, Sean, yeah, you probably have. It's all nice and bright where I'm at. And all of a sudden there's a farmer that walks up in the dark right up on me and i was like um what the heck do you what are you what's going on I'm like what's up bro yeah they got a truck stuck they needed some help but it's all good do i try to just i guess i can try to do that right uh, i would go to the right to the right what good is that Oh, just hear me out. Oh, my so engine you, to the you right. Go to the right. Car to the left. Right. Either, either go to the, either go to the left or go to the right. You get enough speed going back to where you can, gun it or make your engine go left. Your car goes behind you. 
Okay, hang on. Are you looking at stream? Yeah, so where your engine okay. is now, yeah, that's where I'd put the engine. But you go to the to the bridge side first. Try to get enough speed coming back to where you can gun it forward, but go to the left. To the bridge side first. Yeah, you put the car that you have on now in front of you. The bridge side so you can get... I think going the way I... I think where I'm at, I'm fine. But what yeah, I think... Then, but what then I think... you run the risk of clob clobbering that net, Natala but, but what powering I, white car. Antahol. I think what I what I want to do though is I want my engine to go straight back and the car to go to the siding, and then I can flip flop. Because I'd rather have a car hit a car than my engine hit that car. Does that make sense? Uh huh. Okay, so I think that's what I'm gonna do. And I don't need a ton of speed here. But the problem is I got to get up to a point before I can do what I want to do because this is all slopey up here. You know what I mean? Yep. So... Yeah, because I, there's no way... I, I wouldn't have been able to stop the engine. No, you just clobber that car. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> And see that that was oh my god that was perfect. Let's go. Now we just flip flop and we're good to go. I'm a professional. Apparently I never finished or I never hit enter and team speak on that one. Oh. I had like a, apparently a message typed out. Oh. <laughs> and it, I guess it was still from when we were down in stream on. Ah. Uh, and I never night. hit enter. Oh wow. So uh, just don't don't look at my safety rating. Other than that, man, professional. Just saying. Oh, there's railroader. Speaking of that, I need to get those interchange cards in the front. Look at us go, chat. We're really doing it, Harry. Yeah, this uh, little track up here gives you some interesting, like, uh, uh, kick, you know, scenarios that you have to do. Oh, yeah. The same. Now, if I would have known, I would have just brought it in with a different engine. And bada bing, bada boom, done, you know, but it's all right. It's all good. I do know that diesels will make it to there. Granted, it's not that. Once you get up to, like, a Larka's. It's really not that bad. I mean, what do you mean the diesels will make it? Uh, I've had to go go over there in a single player. Oh, this is flat. I haven't. I'm not climbing the hill. Oh yet. no, going to to there is there's a little bit of a hill. Yeah, a but coming it's coming out of Bryson and then B. Yeah, and it, but it's not. Out of, it's not the big uh, boy hill yet. Yeah, it's not big boy hill. Anymore. Yeah, you, you peel off right at the base of the big boy hill. So yeah, it's no big deal to get here. You can, I can send engine one over here with like a decent amount of cargo. It'd be fine. I don't know about that. If you can get it to a locker junction, it'd be fine. Yeah, if, if you get, <laughs> it would just if run you, out. If of, you can get it up there, it would just run out of you know water and stuff. Whatever. Go, go, Gadget. I'll keep my engine at the bottom of the hill until I see what disaster I get. But anyway, so the farmer scared me. And I don't know how he didn't see Dad outside, and Dad didn't know he was there. His truck was parked, like, I don't know, over at the other place, but like, not that far away. And so we go walking out of the shed, and we're kind of chatting and whatever, and Dad turns around and, like, jumps, like, oh, man, you scared me. So Farmer, farmer Fred, it's not his name, Scared, scared dad and I both within like 10 minutes, five That's minutes. Great. It was hilarious. Farmer Fred. Not his name. I'm not telling you his real name, chat. It's Bill. It's not Bill. Definitely not Bill. I can probably say his real name. You get no, nobody would believe me if I did say his real name. It's kind of not a. It's not a super common name. It's 
not a weird name. It's just not a common name. So. That's okay. In fact, there's probably nobody that can hear me right now that uh, has the same name. Oh, Tony! Tony's not his name. <laughs> Tony is definitely not his name. I don't even know. Oh, Tony should know his name. Yeah. Tony doesn't really I mean, I, interact. I kind of hope so because he, he's like the the old lady of the neighborhood like likes to gossip. <laughs> Isn't everybody though? Well, he he is in the industry where yeah. basically that's kind of what we do. That's why you know Dad and I were talking about going to all these going to auctions. Yeah, and I'm like, yeah, the... it's just a social event. Let's go and just hang out with people. <laughs> the problem is, there's auctions in the area, but none of them are like in the area close, like to the farm. They're not like that close in the area. They're like within an hour drive, so may not really know anybody there. Although Big Al was talking about coming down to that one, but yeah. And I did look at, uh, I told you that. That's site you sent me. There's actually something else with an auction. I'll have to, uh, send it to you, officer. Okay. okay, there's two Berkshires. Where's the other two? You get a Berkshire. Problem is, these are going to be backwards and it's going to look stupid. Just saying. Um, that's the cutout. Okay. I want that to actually be the engine we drive, though, so. The lead engine. Alright, let's, uh, let's get eliminated. Let's get eliminated. But that one could use some coal and stuff, but it's, it'll get us where we're going. Between the, all four of them, we'll be fine, hopefully. I hope we're gonna make this in one shot, chat. I really do. You think you can? You think you can? You think you can? I'm gonna have like, I don't even know, just in Brookshire's and coal and water, <laughs> like the weight-wise, is so much. Oh, that's a interchange. I should take that car with me. That, should... that car is really not that bad to kick either. In or out of there? Like in. Well, yeah, but I need it to go out. Yeah, I, I get that. The problem is, where do I put that car to, to hook up to it? Because... I kind of have all my engines up there. I guess I could... Yeah, that's what I'll do. Or wait, how am I going to do this? Now that I'm thinking about it. Do you have an engine on the other end of that whole train? No. But at least for a temporary, you could put your Berkshires, put one on one end, just I... so you could put that interchange car in the rear, and then put the engine that's up front, or that you pulled that car out with, no. then put it back. I'll make it work. Come on. Or you just pull or push that car and then pull. No, what I'll do is I'll. Well, I could do that. But what I'll do is I'll probably hook to this car and then take those other two Berkshires and push them, pull them forward and get this on the back of those two. Yeah, that's what I'll do. It'll be a little bit of a swapsy potato situation, you know? It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Scoopsy potato. Oop. All right, lock it up. Come on. All right, so what we'll do is we'll push that at like 5%, and then we'll grab. Uh, this engine, this engine is cut out. 
And we'll take this engine. Back this up real quick. Come on, buddy. I need you to, like, respond here. Now. No, I got other engines steaming at me. I got to hurry up and move. <laughs> nah, we're fine. I'm controlling four engines out here right now, so, you know. We're living our best life right now, right? I'm just out here living, living my best life. And we got to get clear of the CTC zone, of course. It'll all work when I go back the other way. I guess if you kick that car now, you should be good. It's CTC That's zone, too. Kind of the plan. If you time it right. Except for I can't find the coupler. Turn your camera quick. That's fine. I don't need to kick it. It's fine. Kicking cars gets me in trouble, Trent. Oh, wait, don't. Yeah, I do. Well, you all gotta pay attention where your engine is. Oh, do you? I know there's a certain clip that uh, <laughs> goes evidence. Might show you that I don't know how to sometimes, yeah. <laughs> This maybe. But we kicked it, just not not as aggressive as you know we should have. Fine. Okay, back to CTC. We want normal. Want to back this engine. Pull this engine forward, which will back that engine up. Oh god. This is about to be a frame illa out here all right okay, i'm not doing anything frame killer we should probably do it like a stop and a reset on this game too at some point just yeah, so it hurt. we don't have a crash you know maybe before i head up the hill how about that we'll just take two seconds game save restart only gonna take a minute all right, now we put this on there, and then we move the other two engines. And three out of our four engines are going backwards. <laughs> oh, that's okay though. That means three out of the four will be going forward, coming back back down the hill, right? That's all that means. Okay, now we grab this engine's controls, and we go put it reverse tear. Ready. This is about to be crazy. I'm actually going to unhook all the engines, just see how much weight we have in engines. Because it's going to be like a lot. It all depends on how much coal and water each engine has to enter. Because that all goes into it as well. Alright, back to normal. Forward march. Off with his head. We might drive from the fourth engine. That way we actually have forward controls. Makes sense. The folk, you know. We'll probably drive yeah. from the yeah. Yeah, I don't like having the uh, backwards controls. Yeah. Me. yeah. I, oh, I wanted to go forward. Oh no, I meant to go reverse. Yeah, I don't I don't disagree. So we'll probably do that. All right, hook up. We'll MU and cut this engine out. We'll make sure this engine's the same. This engine needs to be the same. This engine needs to not be cut out. Can't something, what the heck? I got the wrong controls loaded, there we go. Okay, we want to cut loose from that, so. Just in engines, Trent. We're eight cars, obviously, because four engines, four tenders. 1,559 tons. 1,500 tons just of engines, y'all. 
engines, tenders, water's coal, water coal. 3,682 tons total. And I think this is going to be a good spot to uh, take a brief second. Trent, are you moving right now? No, you're good. All right, we're going to take a brief second here. We're going to shut the game down all the way down. Go back to my desktop. This game likes to likes to have issues after a couple hours, so we're gonna, just going to go all the way back out real fast and come all the way back in. Oh, so, yeah. And just like that. Just like that, we uh, should be back. There you go. Did we get the memory? Like, I don't have any mods. So, no. I didn't know there was a mod for that either. I need to apparently read up on the mods for this game, huh? Apparently. All right. So, we're going to drive from this engine. All right. And we are go for launch. <laughs> oh, man. So unaware that there was a fix for it. And uh, like I said, I don't have any mods, so yeah. All right, let's open this bad boy up, get up this hill. What do y'all say, Chad, huh? Open it up. Let's go. It looks so much better if they were all forward. But I don't have anywhere to turn engines down here, so. And I can't. What is track speed here? I'm kind of flying right now. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going 30 right now. Oh boy. I feel like that might be a little faster up there. This is where I would almost be better just to hire it, AI it. I don't know the track. Yeah, see, max speed is 25. I was going 30 plus. <laughs> pretty much pretty much time yet you know controlled full full set right um so far it looks like we're having issues by the way not happy to see that Black Cat 1 ST cheered Dex 100, full send or no send. Black Cat, thanks for the bits. Come on, get in the seat. Come on. There you go. Tea time. Alright. But Sean, we're not we're not in Britain. Hey uh Trent, you wanna like come come give me a push? Yeah, I'll be in there in two years. Alright, cool. If I get through some of these curves I might be okay, but I'm down to ten. I'm on AI, so I can't, you know, it's going to do its job. That's insane. But you pulling like three tons and a lot of that's in your engines. Too. Half of that's my engines. Yeah. Well, not quite You're kind half. Kind of shooting yourself in your own foot there, but they, they have, do, it, they have power, but apparently not enough. But you hurt yourself though at the yeah, same time. I, know. Uh, I need a diesel over here. I hate to say it. Need a bigger train captain, right? No, unfortunately, we need a diesel over here, and I don't like it. I don't like it at all. I mean, it's still going. We'll, we'll just let it go, actually. We're losing speed though. I mean, it's kind of like the, like if you have double diesels from Graham County, it 
still yeah. slow, but it, it still eats at it. Yeah. I think the test that we did was like it would slow down, and apparently, according to Dave, it was like the slowest it got to down was like four, and it didn't like go below that. Well, I'm going five eight now. I'm still moving, so we're gonna let it eat. We're gonna let it eat and see what see what happens here. No, they're all throwing smoke, Sean. One, two. The problem is they're not all the same direction. This is a forward, backwards, backwards, backwards. So these two are close is why it looks weird. But we, we're we still moving. Five, seven. Problem is I think it gets steeper up here. Go up ahead and hit uh, shift Q. Or shift question mark. No, that's good. It's good. Five eight. I mean, we're we're living in that five five seven five eight five nine. We're living there. Problem is, when you get into turns, too, it sucks. Right now, this is a fairly straight run for a little while here. But God, that's so steep. It's so steep here. How steep is this? Yeah, four and a half percent. Four and a half, y'all. That is the killer. I hate to say it, but yeah, we need at least a diesel over here to help. Maybe two. It's three nine here, but again, you got the curves to deal with too, so. Curves definitely don't help, but we're up to six eight, six nine, so we're moving. We're just we're digging right now. So what's going on? What's uh what's papping? Welcome in, how's it going? I mean remember we only need to make it to what, Topton? Yeah. Beyond there it's basically downhill, so I mean, you're getting there. Is that the passenger train? The pa <laughs> passenger train needs some help. <laughs> I mean, it's going eight right now, so it, it is going the right direction. I mean, you have time to go mess with the passenger train. That's that is very true. Actually. <laughs> he, he's not going anywhere. This is not going anywhere fast no. Um, yeah, passenger train, you're kind of not. Oh, that's, that's the passenger? Yeah, yeah, this is the last cars I pulled out over here was from here, so that's why the passenger train is where it is. <laughs> that's funny. Got two interchange cars over here to grab, two more here to grab. I could take a whole, whole run of those back down, too, to the forward. Oh, and a whole line of pulpwood. That's what I mean, pulpwood, yeah. I call it corewood, just from... Railroads Online. This thing needs water. And coal. You can have, like, the, the big new one? What? That new engine from Railroads Online? Yeah. Yeah. That is the test engine. <laughs> Probably. Now you gotta put the snowblower at the front. Uh, and that'll be our full send at the end of the night, right? Those two new, I guess, in a way, or I guess the snowblower is an engine, but yeah, those two engines are really nice look looking together. Yeah, we'll mess around with that game these days again. Automatic cup in it. It's nice. If, or with that, you get the, the actual, like, what we're used to here in Railroader kind of coupling. Yeah. Have you played it? Uh-uh. I've, oh. I've watched uh, videos oh. I got you. of, like, the new stuff. Okay, I was like, wait a minute. Have you been playing Railroads Online? I didn't know about it. Nope. Which is fine if you are. No, the guy was, I guess, having issues with the snowblower. 
I mean, it's it's early, so. It's oh yeah, to turn off the automatic coupling, but. I guess the, if you turn the automatic coupling off, you get the the shin or the pin and shackle. Mm -hmm. But if you turn it on, then you get your cuff or that we get in this game. Yeah, 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 yeah. I did see that. So there's a a thing in the railroader Discord you're talking about, like a chart. But but what fun is that? You know, I just want to hook up and just see if I can pull the hill. You know. And this grade changes, by the way, as well. And I don't know where the steepest part is. I guess you'd have to go up and down the whole track and find it. I mean, we're at six or 9.6 right now. So the strain's doing, I mean, it's gonna chew through the water and cold, but whatever. Most of these engines are pretty, uh, well, that one's kind of light. Uh, yeah, most of these are, it's going to take us a while to fill everything back up when we get up here. But that's okay. It's part of it. It is part of it. But I mean, we're doing it. This is doing fine. As long as it keeps going. Like I said, we only need to go to Tampton, so. We know that hill, though, from. Yeah, that hill sucks coming up, but. <laughs> There's no good good things about that. No, no. The good thing is when you get to the top. That's the only good thing about the hill, the top. And then it's each a, way downhill. Yeah, yeah, it's crazy. And then it's a nice ride over to Andrews. But in the meantime, you know, kind of, kind of real. And a real. Uh, it's like eight, Sean, but we haven't fast time yet today. So, yeah, it's really bad, Sean. It'll be zero when we fast time. So yeah, definitely gonna be zero. That's that is true, Sean. Very true. And it's on AI, so we're not gonna that that train's not gonna have any issues. That train will be fine. You know, those never got spotted in earlier, did they? All because that switch not is not right. Uh, uh, Chuck, we think this game was before OSHA, so... We think it was based before OSHA. Oh, yeah. Oh, what's up, Chuck? What's going on? Safety rating is eight currently. We've had three derailments today, so in-game day. Not actual day, in-game day. One actual day, three in-game day. So yeah, not a big deal. I didn't realize that switch was wrong. Like, oh, yeah, kind of forgot about these logs earlier. That's all right. Get them spotted in now. The uh... oh, the sawmill's doing okay. It's at twenty nine percent. It's all right. Not great, but it's all right. No worries. Probably try to get these and one more set of cars down here in game day before we fast time. All these silver cars ready to go. Ready to go. Alright. Spot you and you'll be fine now. Bye bye. Have a good time. Bye bye. Oh. Oh, we're almost to the fun part here. Oh boy. Skip to the good part. Uh, uh. <laughs> you know, if you get far enough here, you can back in that track up there, which is an uphill to help you get some momentum. But we're also going 10 right now, so we're actually doing quite well. I am very surprised at how this is handling this. Well, kind of and kind of not. 
I was kind of hoping we'd be able to like do better on this hill, but at the same time, this is ungodly steep. And I know we have like, what I say, about 1,500 tons just in engine and tenders and water and coal. I think so. Yeah. 3,600 tons total, so. Tis a bit of weight. Tis a bit. But we should probably get a diesel R2 just to help with the hill. We can still use the Berkshires for the rest of the job of this train, but slap a diesel or two in there too. But that's another like 60 grand I don't want to take out loans. So. Yeah, what's a loan? 87 thousand dollars i wouldn't know trent <laughs> Eighty-five thousand dollars. we're getting better so you're saying there's a chance all right now sean osha wasn't a thing to like the 70s so yeah Oh, we're shedding speed, boys. It's the curves. The curves. The curves are getting us. But we get... Yeah, it's, God, we gotta go way up here still. We gotta go basically to the yard here, like right in this area. That's still 3-4. Oh, my God. Buddy. Bureau of Labor Standards. But we don't have an emote for that, Sean. <laughs> Alright. God, this is how steep is this? Four and a half percent. Four and a half percent with the curves. If it wasn't curved, I could. It wouldn't be that big of a deal. Yeah, These, it, would. it wouldn't be anywhere near as big of a deal. These switchback curves are what's killing me now. This drains in like four turns at once. Obviously, that's a problem. You know. Obviously, that's a, that's an issue. Down to three three. We're gonna have rescue. We're gonna have to rescue cars from this hill. I can see it now. You should already know what I'm about to say. I need diesels. No. Nope. Oh what? No, it's that attitude. <laughs> Problem is, I gotta stop. They're not dead yet. And throw air on all of them. Yeah. Uh, this game is pre-made. You have to unlock tracks as you go, though. So you don't you don't have everything. Uh, when you start. So yeah. And you're you're done. Oh, I'm done. Yeah, I'm done. Uh, so let's see. Where's like halfway? Yeah, this looks good right here. You're the weakest link. Yep. <laughs> you are the weakest link. Goodbye. John, the problem is there's no help on this end of the map to send. This is it, buddy. We do have a diesel switcher and technically the passenger train. Up there. But yeah, the diesel switcher is up at Disboro. It's at uh, Andrews. Andrews. You really have two helpers. That's the closest thing to you. <laughs> Yeah, this bro, it's the, no, Andrews, there's a diesel switcher and then the passenger train, but that wouldn't be, the passenger train wouldn't be that much help. That's the closest help to you. So we just, we just shed a thousand tons, by the way, roughly. 
Yeah. And look at us go. <laughs> this still might take three tries to get up the hill. Good gosh. It just doesn't, like, how many engines can we put on this so we can actually make it, you know? Need like 10 engines to make this. Big Al, what's going on? Welcome to the hill climb of the century. Or, you know, the every in-game day. <laughs> the hill climb. I could also try... That we can't do? Uh, the logging machine, or logging engines. True, yeah. Very true. Dude, I want to mess with that reverser so bad, but I know that I shouldn't touch it because it's... Nope. Yeah, as soon as you nope. touch that reverser, I'm done. you are done. I'm done. That's pretty much why whenever I ran, or when we used to run steams and you were asking why I did never touch the reverser. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just live at 8.4 miles an hour apparently forever. Just so. touch, you just mess around with the throttle. Um, I mean, it's just such a crazy track, you know? Crazy track. Trent, you want to bring your double diesels over real quick? You're like an hour away from me. Like, real time, you're an hour away from me. Oh, well, if you green light everything. It would still take you forever. I'll get yeah, it. Yeah, but the, also the issue with Sean's uh, little post there is if I do come over. Yeah. <laughs> then I gotta get. I gotta get back. Well, we can get the switcher too. Why don't you go grab the switcher? Although by the time you get it here, I'll probably have the stuff to tap to. Yeah. Maybe we'll see. I'm really not that far away. Yeah, I mean, you almost made it. Yeah. The problem is, is the the curves are is what. Oh, kills the curves me. are killer. Just absolute murdering me right now. It's not the slope's bad. Yes. Because as soon as your one end of the train is on one end, one curve, the yeah. back end is on like a third, an, another curve. <laughs> Three different. I mean, you got so many curves going at the same time. Yeah, it's just killer. If this was somehow a straight shot at this grade, wouldn't be anywhere near as bad. It's like four and a half percent right now, which we know from uh, railroads online. It's not a fun grade. Apparently, it won't let me uh, check here. What does it say? Yeah, four point one. So we're getting a little better, but we still have curves. That ten degree curve. Yeah, the the curves are not. I mean, look at this. This is crazy right now. Not helping. Not helping at all. Well, and plus, you're like you're pulling loaded cars too. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Too bad. Sean really wants us to go to the double diesel or the uh, not the double the. Uh, the switcher. The switcher, I guess. Yeah. It's the closest engine, but it's still probably, it's it's a few minutes away. Your switcher or the switcher up there plus passenger train. Or oh. passenger engine. Bring them down. If you want to. I don't care. I mean, the way that you have it all planned out, it's working pretty well. Yeah. I mean, we know that there's only about a thousand tons down the hill, so... That's not... It shouldn't be too much... Too bad. You pretty much have a thousand tons in engine. Yeah. More than a thousand. But there's our target right there. That's that's stopped it right there. So I mean, we're we've made it. You're like one curve away. Yeah. Which is kind of like the sad part is like you almost made it with the two thousand tons that you pull. Yeah. Wow, Sean. Wow, Sean. The jury, huh? We the jury, huh? All right, Pedro. 
It was a tie vote in the poll that Sean posted there. And look at that. We crossed the hill and all of a sudden we're going like way fast. And I need to slow down. I don't really like going through switches yeah, you hit, 20. So you like the, the flat spot in a way of the track. Yeah. 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 As soon as you hit that flat spot, man, it takes off. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and then one, one side, the, the concept is going downhill. The other side is still mm -hmm. trying to go uphill. Yeah. And now just look at this, just coasting now that I've let off the brake. Look at the acceleration. Cause this is, this is pretty steep going downhill. Now this is three, two going downhill. So it's just a struggle going over here. Sure. Struggle bus. Yeah. All the diesels. Need them all, apparently, chat. Probably just need to keep the brake on, huh? Slow down a little bit, though. Good thing there's a nice long uh, siding here. Nice. There's a nice yard here. <laughs> Not really a yard. Just a siding. Nice siding. So that's good. Do stop train, please. Thank you. All right, we gotta pull up, hit the switch, back down the hill, and try not to clobber things. <laughs> <laughs> try to be controlled going down the hill and not absolutely run over the cars that we left on the slope. Because we definitely don't want to do that. Definitely not. Hopefully that doesn't happen. Hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. I'm waiting for that red light to go off on the left up there. That guy right there. One car. There you go. Now remember, now we're climbing a hill again, so it's going to take a minute to... Oof. Back up the hill now. But as soon as we hit the top, we'll know when we hit the zone, you know? Because we'd be coasting after that. Oh boy, oh boy. All right, there's the top of the hill. We're gonna find it. We're gonna get them. Ivers are planting beans, apparently. Dad found a video of a guy in central Illinois planting beans like last week already. Well, uh, granted, they posted this an hour ago, which I'm guessing he probably. They are planting, I'm guessing. Yeah. At least his dad is. At least saw him, yeah. Oh, yeah, his dad plants all the beans. He plants Jeez, all the beans. You're already planting beans, but granted, yeah. as many acres as they farm, that they usually you kind of have to. Kind of have to. Kind of have to. Usually it pays off for them, too. Yeah. Alright, we're going to hit the top of the hill here in a second, I swear. Eh, not quite yet. It's up here. Come on. Well, these engines sure have acceleration when it's just the engines, you know? 1,505 tons of steel, hole in water. All right, we've officially crested the hill, y'all. Now we need to slow down because we're going way too fast for these curves. <laughs> I don't like going 35 up here. Just throwing that out there. <laughs> Maybe like 20, not 35. No, thank you. 
Good gosh, trying to have an incident. So, trying are you sure you want all of your interchange on your map to go to Silva or to, to uh, oh, no, it? I still Andrews? have uh, Silva open. I know, but aren't you changing it all to Andrews? Uh -uh. I'm, not, you... I'm not on check marking. I'm still keeping <sighs> Silva check mark. Yeah, I thought you were changing all yours over. I'm changing the pulpwood side. To... Oh, I guess you're not going to run both pulpwoods. Uh, -uh. That, that's that's because pre pretty much there. That's the only thing there at Silva is. I got you. Pretty much it revolves around pulpwoods. Yeah, yeah. Is... yeah. But you'll still have interchange cars coming and going. I got you. Yep. Okay, makes sense. But yeah, I'm going to try to pulpwood west and interchange. I'm going to try to. Make that go east to Silva. I gotcha. Because well, if I don't have to fight the hill. Godspeed. <laughs> well, you still... and that and that way I don't have to. I don't. I don't need like. Eighty four di uh, uh, diesel. Or twelve different diesels, or get Ber like so many Berkshires. Or... Yeah. Well, you're still gonna if you're bringing upwood out here though. You're still gonna have to fight hills. Not that many from Graham County. Uh, it's still a pretty good amount. Of, that's where I, right where I'm at. Graham County's right back here. So it's still a pretty good good amount of hill you have to fight both ways. So I think if I recall, I think Dave did test, and we tried it with 18, which is basically essentially a full Graham County. Mm -hmm. And I believe he he was able to pull it off. It was like three or four. Because Graham County is right. But granted, he right here. This is Graham he County. He attached all, or he attached the first line, second line, backed up to the third, and got and kept on backing up. Oh, yeah, get a little moment. And then get a a run at it. Yeah. Come that on. way he, he was able to get it good. Yeah, the problem is the momentum doesn't really get you that far. Uh, it's a heck of a hill over here. I was doing that the other day too and I wasn't able to pull them on. I granted I didn't have diesels. I know. Oh, we are zooming now. We got the zoomies now. I think we're actually going to have to slow down at some point, but we'll, we'll go ahead and let it run for now. Of course, we only have 2,300 tons, and we know like 1,500 of that is trained, so. <laughs> Less than 1,000 tons of actual like cars and cargo. Not bad. Not bad at all. I'm just a little concerned about dropping engines here. Now we're fine. We got like 7,000 water. 14, 7. Oh, there goes an engine. There goes an engine. Uh, my two lowest ones are 7, 9 on water. So we're, we're fine. We're chilling. Yeah, right now to one inch of chat. No, <laughs> cat, I hope not. I would definitely hope not. But instead of going like eight, we're going 16 right now. So almost 17. We're doing a lot better on this pole, obviously. A lot less weight here. Mm, yeah, okay. A lot less weight here. Like yeah, thanks for the bets. Appreciate it. Seventeen point one. Twenty-one point one gigawatts. 